Hey everyone, here is a question on rational numbers and the question here is list 5 rational numbers between minus 3 and minus 3.5. So what we are going to do here is we are going to convert them into rational numbers like minus 3 and minus 3.5 are here uh, not in the form of rational numbers. We are going to convert them into rational numbers first. So we know that minus 3 can be also written as minus 3 by 1 which is a rational form. Okay. Even minus 3 is also a rational number. We can write it as minus 3 by 1. Minus 3.5 can be written as minus 3, minus 35 by 10. I am removing the decimal. We are going to place 10 in the denominator. Now we are going to find the rational numbers between minus 3 by 1 and 35 by 10. So whenever we have to find the rational numbers, we have to make sure that denominators are same. So here they are not same. We have 1 and we have 10. So we will take LCM of 1 and 10. So that will get the same denominator. So LCM of 1 and 10 will be 10. Now I'll go and change the denominator of minus 3 by 10. And for the minus 35 by 10, it will remain same. So minus 3 by 1. So we have to make denominator 10. So for that we have to multiply with 10 in the numerator and denominator. It's like you're finding the equivalent rational number of minus 3 by 1 which is minus 30 by 10. The both are equivalent here. And for the second number I'm, I'm not changing because the denominator is already 10. Now you can see that between minus 30 by 10 and minus 35 by 10 we have a numbers like minus 31, minus 32 so on up to minus 34. But in the question, they are asking us to find out 5 and here we got only 4, right? We have to find out 5 rational numbers between these two. But here we got only 4. So what we can do here? So here we are going to find out another equivalent rational number of these two. That is minus 30 by 10 and minus 35 by 10. So for these two numbers, we are going to find out another equivalent rational number. So minus 3 by 1 is equal to minus 30 by 10 we got and uh, here we are going to either multiply or divide. So I am going to prefer multiplying like you can get the equivalent uh, rational number either by multiplying or dividing. Better is to multiply because by dividing you have to take the common factors and do it. So better take the multiplication part. Now we are going to find the uh, equivalent number for both minus 30 by 10 and minus 35 by 10. So when you are uh, finding the equivalent rational number, you can multiply with any number, right? Uh, make sure that you are multiplying with same number. Like here I am going to multiply with 2 in the numerator, denominator. We got minus 70 by 20. Now with the same number, we have to multiply with second number that is minus 35 by 10. I am going to multiply the numerator and denominator with 2. I am not changing any other number because the denominator has to be same. So this will be equal to, sorry, the it will be minus 60 by uh, 20, not 70. So minus uh, 60 by 20 and the next, second one will be minus 70 by 20. Alright, now you can see that we got uh, many numbers between minus 60 by 20 and uh, minus 70 by 20. You can start with 61. So minus 61, minus 62, so on up to minus 69. So these are the numbers we have in between and we have to just pick any 5 rational numbers and put it down. So here uh, we are going to just write down any 5. So therefore 5 rational numbers between minus 3 and minus 3.5. It's okay if you don't write minus 60 by 20 and minus 70 by 20 because they all are equivalent. So they are all are equal here. They are just in another form but they all are equal. So I am going to write down minus 3 and minus 3.5 are minus 61 by 20, minus 62 by 20. You can pick any any numbers between it's completely upon you well, another important thing is there are infinitely many rational numbers between two rational number so my answer may not match with your answer like here i have multiplied with two right you may multiply with four or five in that case the answer will differ so it, it's okay if the answer is different the thing is they should lie between the two given number so that's it thanks for watching